For the young guns, their damaged loader tyre has been easily fixed with little more than a pump. Now that it's fully inflated, the challenge is to position it back under the Caterpillar track. We'll pull the tracks back and if you want to just try and kick it, yeah, I got we'll it try here. and line it up and get it on. All right, you ready? Yep, one, two, three. It's not budging at all. Push, JC. No, I'm bloody pushing, mate. Push harder. Can we get it? Are we close? No, we're not. The load is integral to our operation. It's how we move dirt around. If we don't have that, then we're on buckets and shovels. We need something to stretch the tracks out. We'll head over to the shed, see what we can make. Mitch is over there. Unseasonal rain has put the young guns on alert. To keep flood water out of their mine, they need to be able to build dirt walls. But for that, they need their loader fixed. Jay's got a bit of a device in his head that he's going to rig up using this jack. Well, I'm thinking if we have this sitting in between both tyres, we've got one wheel this side of it, one wheel pressing up against here, and then as we undo it, it's going to stretch it back out. We're just going to need something, yeah. you know, off the side here. With the bottom of the jack propped against one wheel and the top of the jack modified to grab onto the other wheel, they hope to be able to jack the wheels apart to tension the rubber track. That's sick. Let's well go. done. Turn off. Oh, here we go. Please, bloody hold. Is that going? Yeah. It's going. It's working. Look at this. Oh. That's the first bit. <laughs> Push, boys. Yeah. How far off is it? We're so close. So close. <laughs> That's it, that's it. OK, you've got to move with the thing. You've got to move it forward a little bit. Move it up a little bit more. Pull up. Pull up. Uh, a little bit Push more forward, safe. I think. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Holy oh shit, get a pop on Yeah, wow, baby. We've had a sharp learning curve, learning how to fix all this machinery. You know, you have to do it and you have to get stuff fixed or you're not going to be making any money. By sunrise, the threatening clouds have all but cleared. Hey, man. Morning. What's wrong? My freaking foot. I don't know what's going on with it, but I can't really stand on it. Ooh. It looks swollen. We'll go down to the hospital and you can meet the local nurse. All right. The difficult repair job has taken a toll on JC. It was kind of deep cut on the side of my foot, and I just left it, didn't think anything of it. It does hurt. That's a bad sign. So JC's been the main operator of the digger. He knows how to use it the best, so it's really hard for us to lose him. We pretty much have the mine ready, the digger's in place, everything's ready to go, and then, you know, something like this happens. The young guns are waiting for the verdict on JC's infected foot wound. No, there he is. Oh, what's that in his leg? <laughs> what is that? What's wrong, man? What the heck's going on? It's not, <laughs> it's not good. What's wrong? I'm bugging. Well, it's infected. They don't want me walking on it at all. They don't want me doing any kind of work. That sucks. Yeah. yeah. Rest up. I know. It's not looking good at all. He's got compression bandage all the way up his leg. They've given him a heap of different antibiotics. I don't know what we're going to do, honestly. JC's injury means the young guns are without their digger operator. Bloody stupid. Yeah. Yeah. Up we get. Thanks, boys. Straight through there, we've got that glassy oh, stuff. Oh, look at that. And just say, look. Oh, yeah, look at that. We've got a stone in the wall. Where's the broken bit? Oh, have a look at this. Oh, oh. Dude, that's good. With their digger operator, JC, injured and Noah at the helm for the first time, the young guns have struck Opal. I mean, if we didn't break it, we probably wouldn't have seen it. So I guess that's a positive. But you know, I think if we're going to try and use the digger to get it out, we'll need uh, a bit finer controls. So we've found some Opal. It's a spot JC's been digging and uh, we could definitely use his help with the more finesse of the controls to, you know, dig it out without breaking it. 
Check it out, JC. What's this? <laughs> a little bit of opal. That's the first bit. There's some still in the wall. I'll come and dig it. Just need to find out a way to get you down there. I still can't walk, but I'm keen to come down. We've got the wheelbarrow. We can put you in that. Yeah, put me in a wheelbarrow. How's it going? You good? <laughs> All right, legs really sore right now, but this is unreal. The boys have chomped into some opal and um, about to dig it out, so spirits are back up. You might be down in the dumps and it just takes one bit of colour to bring you back up, make you feel 100% again. Uh, it's a power of opal. It's like we've got the good opal happening now in the middle. If you just come up the top here and just press straight in diagonally there, kind of. I'll try, yeah, I'll try and go as much as I can. Oh, here we go, here we go. Yeah, good. Oh. Oh. Holy shit. We've got some opal here, boys. Oh, oh, oh. That's some colour, eh? That's worth getting out of bed for. It's worth coming down the line. Oh, oh, thanks for bringing me down, boys. Let's go. Boys. Nice work. You good? Oh, you right? Thanks forever. Let's head back out of the mine. Woo! She's looking clean and crispy. <laughs> we definitely got some Boy. color in there. Look at that. That's uh, gem quality greens, blues. I reckon at least six grand for this handful, just this handful, and probably another four for what we've got in there. I reckon we've got 10 grand all up. 10 G's, what do you reckon, reckon? boys? That's, That's unreal. unreal. This is at the beginning of the digging. Oh, yeah. This is. this is just like the start of it. Tip of the iceberg. It's a million dollar Bloody mine, ice. I reckon. It's Bloody a million ice. dollar mine. <laughs> <laughs> unreal. Well done, boys. The Young Gun's parcel of blue-green crystal opal is in the rough, weighs 500 grams, and has an estimated value of $10,000. I think it's probably a turning point for the Young Guns. We've spent a lot of time getting to this stage, and now that we're here, we can properly hunt some opal. Now that we know it's turning into colour in one spot, who knows about the whole rest of the mine? We could have colour everywhere in there. We have all the new machines. We're super young, we're super keen. We're so happy to give it a crack. Let's go get a burger. Yeah. You need a hand? Right. Yeah, cheers me. Yeah, we go. Come on, mate. Bloody hopeless. Get your burger. Have the rest of today off, and you'll be back on your feet tomorrow, I reckon. <laughs>